Hey Russell fam, in today's video I am hosting a collaboration if I wrote a letter to my first year homeschool self. Be back in just a second. Hi, my name is Becky and welcome to Russell's Loving Life. I am a homeschooling mom of two and I have been homeschooling since 2012. If you are new to our channel, welcome. We are so glad you are here. If you are new to our channel, please consider subscribing and clicking that little bell notification. That will let you know every time we upload a new video. We also have a blog which is russellslovinglife.com. where I talk about homeschooling tips and tricks and things that I have learned all through my years of homeschooling. Make sure to sign up for our email list. Um, I like to send out discount codes for all of my affiliates and we also have a store. Which you can check in the description box below. Um, it has lots of homeschool supplies, curriculums, things like that, um, just tools that I have used over the years that I thought you may find helpful. If you are returning Russell fam, I am so glad you are back. In today's video, like I said, I am hosting a collaboration and I will leave that playlist down in the description box where a whole bunch of awesome homeschool moms are getting together and we are writing a letter to our first year homeschool self. Now, I sat down and I got to thinking, what would I say to myself back then? And it just all poured out. And when I thought about this collaboration, I wanted to do it because I know there are so many homeschooling parents that are new this year, and I want to encourage them and support them and support you um, in your homeschooling journey. So that is why I came up with this collaboration and I'm going to read the letter that I wrote to my first year homeschool self. So here goes. Dear Becky, I know this is your first year of homeschooling Bailey and he is entering kindergarten and you feel stressed, worried, overwhelmed, scared you can't do it, scared you will fail, but breathe. You are his mother and you know what is best for him. You made the right choice with the My Father's World curriculum. It will be rocky at first, but do not give up. Use that support system that you have found in the homeschool group. That group is not just for Bailey. It is for moms too. Ask questions. There are no dumb questions. Learn what has worked for them or what has not worked for them. But know that your homeschool may not look like theirs. Never compare yourself or your child or your homeschool to theirs. What works for them may not work for you. Find what works for you and go with that. Every child is different. Every child learns differently. Make sure to have fun. I know you think it has to look like school did when you went, but it doesn't. As long as Bailey is learning the core subjects, he will be just fine. Make sure to take breaks when you need them. If you both get frustrated, he will not learn anything. Never forget you know what is best for your child. You got this and you will do great. Always remember to be flexible, consistent, and encouraging. Breathe, relax, and always put your family first. Stay with my father's world curriculum because it is awesome. And growing with grammar, add that. It, uh, and do not use spelling power. It doesn't work well for us. I know you like schedules, but they do not work well. 
you will find a routine that works best. So do not stress about starting and stopping at a specific time. Remember, you are a mom and you've got this. Days will not always run smoothly, and that's okay. There will always be good and bad days. Just go with the flow, and it all works out. So, if you are a first-time mom of homeschooling, I hope this letter that I wrote to myself helps you. I hope it encourages you. Know that there is going to be bumpy days. There is going to be great days. There's going to be amazing days. But once you find what works for your family, you will go with the flow and you will get it done. So don't give up. I know you're overwhelmed. I know you're stressed, but it does get better. Just keep going. Find what works. Find your rhythm and you will succeed. The reason I started my YouTube channel and my blog is because I wanted every homeschool mom to know that they have support and that I want them to feel encouragement. I don't want you to feel overwhelmed or stressed, but as a mom, I know that's like telling you not to breathe. You're going to be stressed. You're going to be overwhelmed, but it gets better. You can do this. So don't let anyone ever tell you that you can't. It is legal to homeschool in all 50 states. Just make sure you follow your state laws and you can do this. And don't forget to look in the description box below to check out the playlist to see all the other homeschool moms that have written letters to themselves. And I hope you find encouragement and support in those. If you have any homeschool questions, drop them down in the comments. If I don't know the answer to it, I will find a homeschool mom that knows that answer. So never feel like you are homeschooling alone on your journey. As always, remember to be kind, be careful, be considerate, and have a great day. Bye.